like what's your mother's maiden name? Something they would only know. Now that's pretty good, but what if we go a little bit more specific? Like what was the name of your elementary school? Ooh, or what's your pet's name? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the first concert they've ever been to or have you ever been to prison? Yeah, maybe, wait, what? What's up? No, sorry, did you say whether or not they went to prison? Yeah, I mean, to help verify their identity. What if we just asked them, like, what's the make and model of your first car? Yeah, yeah, see, that's good. Or maybe, like, what advice would you give to somebody who might be going to prison for the first time? Uh, what? I mean, we need to make sure it's actually them that are trying to log in, right? This is about safety, dude. For sure, I just don't really know if that's, like, the direction we want to go. That's kind of... Okay, Jesus Christ, man, I get it. Okay, um, maybe more like, what did you want to be when you grew up? Or what was the name of your first pet? Yeah, 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 okay. Or, or like, what's your favorite color? Or, or uh, if you have to go to prison because you got arrested for kidnapping, do they treat you good? Or do they treat you bad? Do they treat you bad? Like, do they treat you like a molester if you, if you just kidnapped somebody? Or do they kind of treat you like a criminal and give you respect? Did you kidnap somebody? It's not kidnapping, dude! It was, it was a misunderstanding, man. Shit! What's that sound? Shut up! Be quiet! You're being loud! It's annoying! What the hell? Did you kidnap somebody? No, dude, I thought he was gonna attack me, so I had to protect myself. You stole a person, dude! What? No, what? no, he showed up at my apartment and I felt threatened, so I acted in self-defense by neutralizing the enemy. Is he a delivery guy? You kidnapped a delivery guy? No, dude, see, that's it. I didn't order any food, and now this mysterious man shows up at my apartment with food. Yeah, right, he's probably just trying to come inside so he could gut me like a fish. He probably went to the wrong address. You don't believe me? Tell him, tell him why you're the here. Tell him man. the truth. I need delivery in Unit 210. I knew it. It was, it was the wrong address, dude. Let him go. This is Unit 201, dude. You're at the wrong freaking unit. I, I know, I'm sorry. I won't tell anybody. Just, just let me go. Just please, just let me go. It's okay, dude. You're going to be okay. Everything's okay. You're going to die today. Dude, what? No, he went to the wrong apartment. <laughs> What's your name, dude? Josh. Josh Russo. Sounds like a government name, dude. I'm gonna make an example out of you. No, man, I just, please, I made a mistake. My name is Josh. Stop lying. Dude, stop. There's an easy way to settle this. Josh, what was the name of the elementary school you attended? Uh, Pioneer Elementary. <laughs> okay, what's your mother's maiden name? Uh, Clark. Yeah, okay, what's the make and model of your very first car? I had a 2006 Nissan Altima. I lost my virginity in it. Come on, man, that's enough. Let him out. It's gonna be okay, man. It's gonna be okay. By the way, if you guys want a little bit of this food, you're gonna have to. Oh my God! You just shot a guy! He went from kidnapping to murder, dude! What the fuck? What the fuck? We gotta call the cops! What are you doing? You just moved. His first you... car what? was a 2006 Nissan Max. I am Tom Cruise. I am Tom Cruise. <sighs> Hello, everybody. If you work out hard, you might become Tom Cruise. You probably won't, but what you'll definitely have is some sore muscles. That's why after my workouts, I go straight to Magnesium Breakthrough from Bioptimizers. It can help you ease into sleep, it can help your muscles recover, and magnesium has a hugely positive impact on your immune system. Get a discount at magnesiumbreakthrough.com slash Brent Pella. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a Tom Cruise to become. I'm Top Gun. I'm Top Gun. Ugh.